The average Canadian produces 2.2 kilograms of solid waste each day. This amounts to 30 million tons of waste produced in Canada every year. The waste that isn't recycled, reused, or burned will end up in a landfill. Our current engineering solution to this waste problem is to continually develop landfill sites and recycling facilities. These developments are not only expensive and a threat to our environment, but they are only a temporary solution to our problem of waste production. To fully solve any problem, we must first identify it. Why are we producing so much solid waste? It could be that we are not considering the full life cycle of the things we throw away. Consumer society has taught us that it's okay to use a product only once for the sake of convenience. From this, we have learned to only consider a product when it is in our hands. So when we use a product that comes in a single-use plastic package, we often take for granted the amount of energy and natural resources required to produce the product. And we rarely think of where it will end up when we dispose of it. While the movement towards recycling is a step in the right direction to reduce waste, it is not a solution in itself. Recycling facilities are expensive, and it requires a lot of energy to make new products from old ones. From an engineering design point of view, we need to incorporate life cycle analysis into the items we design. We currently design cheap, single-use items because it is convenient for consumers and because the constant consumption of these products has economic benefits to companies. Some of the products we currently design may only be used for a matter of minutes before they are thrown away, while much of this waste will remain in our environment. Most of us take for granted that materials such as plastic do not decay in our natural environment. And rather, this plastic only breaks down into smaller pieces. This means plastic can remain in our environment for centuries, posing serious threats to ecosystems worldwide. Why not design products that only last for required use? If we were to use a holistic approach to design, that is, thinking of the whole life cycle of an item, including all the materials and energy required for production, as well as disposal, we may be able to come up with more appropriate solutions. We have the ability to design products that are less energy intensive to produce and that will readily biodegrade in the environment once disposed of. Waste production at its root is a social problem. And regardless of technical solutions, we must address social issues before progress can be made. The solution to the waste production problem lies not only in encouraging communities to reduce the amount of waste they produce by thinking of the life cycle of a product, but also by designing products, keeping their life cycle in mind so that we can provide an alternative option to single-use items.